You don't cast last last now everybody go chop breakfast even though my voice is very terrible i said i'm gonna start this video with that song so guys the breakfast has already started being saved we're not even up to one week in and we're already hearing all this i didn't do this i didn't do that it's gonna be a very 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 long season i'm sorry for actually bringing this video late Big Brother has decided to turn us into night crawlers because I don't understand why he doesn't turn off the lights early. Like he, by 2 a.m., 3 a.m., light is still on. Housemates are still very much awake. Shane will not be sleeping again <laughs> during this period. But yeah, um, let's talk about. I'm just going to briefly talk about the the situation between um, Groovy and Beauty, and then we'll also talk about what happened. The guys discussing who they like, who they did not like, and then Shags and what they call it, Shags and Bella trying to sort themselves out. Welcome back to my channel guys. If you are new here, please do to subscribe, turn on your post notifications so that I can get this every time I post a brand new video. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up. So last night there was an issue between Beauty and Groovy. And what caused this issue? Groovy did not hold Beauty's hands in the arena. That is the only thing that caused this issue. Beauty said that he was trying to or he was he was trying to put out, he was trying to make it seem like they are not close when he went to the arena. So that was Beauty's own problem. And I was like, ah. How is this one causing this kind of major issue already? Imagine if they had done the, um, their pool party together. What would now have happened? Where everybody is like on bikini. And you know those islanders, those island babes, they have very big <laughs> behind. It would have been very, very crazy if like they did their pool party together. Big brother, you're seeing the contents that you made us miss. So yeah, that's what caused the issue between them. And then um, last night, so we was just trying to make her understand that that's not the case you're actually getting mad at something that like over something that is not true it's okay, it's fine. I believe you. you believe me but you don't want to talk to me you don't have to be cool what do you mean we don't have to be cool okay fine i'm cool if you say we're cool we're going to talk to you tomorrow morning and you can't ignore me well, it's my choice this whole thing started off like a joke oh. beauty was just saying it's in front of the other housemates that oh this is what he did and all like, and i was thinking that they were joking only for her to just you know get later get more angry they went to bed that's when grooving i went to you know talk to her um in bed there meanwhile amaka was just getting very very excited about the whole issue like the comments she was making the fact that she was singing when they were talking i was like amaka 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 come go do down calm down relax 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 beauty now ended up saying that um they should not even talk at all that in fact they should just avoid each other that she said today Ninth party is coming and everybody will um, go and have fun that they should not talk at all. Let's not talk to each other. At least for now. Until we got news. And it's perfect because tomorrow brings me already with so free. I don't give a fuck about that. If the party comes, the party comes, we'll have fun. I know that. No, we are gonna have fun, I'm gonna have fun. We're gonna have to school. <laughs> so now she's referring to the party. Beauty, I'm suspecting you. I'm suspecting you. It's possible that the reason she's even doing all of this is so that she can free herself and then when they go to the party, she can have fun or she can just free herself with the other guys. Maybe there's somebody she's even eyeing on the island that she's doing all these things. Because for me, I didn't see this situation as a very, very big deal. Or maybe she's actually genuine in like, um, you know, obviously like um, saying this is what he did to her and all of that. I don't know because I didn't I didn't see all of that So I don't know. It's one of those two things. Sha. Now for what was happening on the island The guys were talking about the ladies that they think are feeling them and then the ladies that they are also feeling right and giddy fire was <laughs> Giddy fire was the coordinator. He was just really like oh, yeah, you know talk your own talk your own This thing is gonna help us and um, when we're trying to do our task the whole thing was just giving me um, men's conference from Big Brother South Africa. If you followed Big Brother South Africa, you know about the men's conference that they had. But this one is, is a little bit lighter, right? So that's just like what they were doing in the room. And for that, Elo Swag said that he's feeling all the girls. Baba for the girls. Giddy Fire Sena is going to help them in their task. Like, how is this going to help them in their task? Just say that you want to hear this. Which one is, is going to help us in our task? How is this, this the solution to the fact that you guys lost your arena games? It's not going to help. So, for Hemis, he said that all the ladies are feeling him. <laughs> That all the ladies are feeling him that the way when he's talking that the way their their eyes light up and they're just like, <laughs> I'm like 
all the girls are feeling for yeah. fans. The one obstacle is that I made it clear that I'm getting married and I'm going to say this shit. And then again, like, every time when I have talk, I see how their eyes wow, light no. up. It's like, God, wow. this boy, that cash you. <laughs> it's the confidence for me, like, all the ladies, like, all of them, the way their eyes light up. I'm like, ah, ah, Hermes, hottest boy in town. <laughs> So, you know, that's just what he said about the people that are feeling him. For the for those that he's feeling, he said that um, he's feeling Chomzy, Chichi, and Alison. For Chomzy, he said that he just, there's this thing about her that's kind of like babyish and he just likes the innocence. She's so fine. so attractive. And then for Chichi, he said that it's, it's purely sexual. Then he was now describing her body and everything. I'm like, hey, help me so. This help me so this help me is gonna be a problem for us in this house. Chichi is basically sexual and make clear like that girl that she's then going to say a whole lot of women. Bro, a whole lot of women bro <laughs> address this time like you know shift. Then for Alison, he just said that he for for that one eh, it just makes him speechless. As in that one is gone, he's a gone man when it comes to Alison's situation. For Alison is ah god. Alison, come on, carry him so see what you are doing to somebody's son. And then for Dotun, Dotun said, okay no, Shag said um, oh, um he feels like doing it doing is feeling him obviously because she has told him and then obviously it's, it's Bella that he's feeling and then um Dotson said for him he feels like Chomzy is feeling him obviously I've been doing she said it's so all of us yeah she yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know I'm not 100 sure yeah. but I feel like Chomzy is feeling him. okay before he proceeded to talk about the people that he's feeling Shags um you know there's already conversation now happened Shags was now talking about the fact that he feels like um, no, no, he was talking about the conversation that he had with Bella, right? So Bella, you guys know that Bella told him that she thinks that all the guys, um, you know, all the guys would have maybe tried to um, talk to her, but because of him, they're not doing that. So he now revealed it to the other guys that, you know, this is what she said. Also the fact that they are friends, so they will not want to like, you know, betray him and all of that. He just like um, said that to them. Like obviously they, they were feeling her, but they see that like she's sticking to me, she's on me. So they don't want to activate her. She also feels like us guys are actually friends. So nobody really wants to step on my toes. Then it was at this point that Dotu was now talking about who he's feeling. So he said that for doing that, um, he would have been feeling her on a physical level and all of that but um he, he has noticed that they're not really compatible and they are friends so they've established their friendship but when it comes to like somebody that he would have probably had something to do with on the relation relationship level that it would have been bella but obviously like as shakes now talked about this whole thing he now confirmed he now confirmed what she said that yeah that he would have uh, maybe tried to pursue stuff with bella but he based on the fact that they are friends he's not gonna do that and all of that i say okay oh, Boundaries are being established here. <laughs> but the fact that my guy is on so ah, yeah, he's on ah right now. Honestly, you give me that respect. I actually really think that Bella is very beautiful, but I like Bombo. Okay, now Kunle said he likes Bombo. I'm not surprised because. I can remember during the pool party, he was just all over Alison, and then when he was trying to dance with her, he was always trying to turn her around to to get a better view from behind or get a better feel from behind. Then about the information that Shex gave them about like you know the whole Bella Bella situation, he was saying that um, initially she was just saying that this is not what she wants, like um, the fact that she doesn't want the whole shipping shipping thing that she, is what she's trying to avoid. Then he now told her that Amor, if she doesn't want that kind of thing that he's gonna stay away and then let them just cut things off that he's not here to follow anybody around if the person is not expressing themselves to him da, 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 da. you know he was just dropping it dropping it and i said yeah i didn't come up with the intentions to do that so we had a whole conversation and then i said yeah like let's free up like let's wake up tomorrow you go about your business let me go about my business i'm tapping out like i because I, I ain't i'm not this guy i'm not going to be chasing you around if you can't say look I like you and I want to do this. I don't think that's that should be information for the guys. Like, what are they using this information to do? It just felt like he was just trying to make the guys know that, okay, I'm still very much in control of the relationship. I've told her I'm not going to do this if she doesn't want. I, you know, that kind of thing. Like, it just felt like he was trying to, you know, show that, okay, I'm still very much in control. That's, that's the way it seemed because... You know what, what was the point of that information then he also spoke about like kissing and no kissing that he said i be according to him that he said he's not going to do that you know he's not going to do that just he just wants her to know that he's there for her he really really likes her that 
the way he sees that is she's the kind of person that overthinks things and then he doesn't want her to feel like he's there for something else he's there for her body or he's there for he's just there to hit and run that kind of thing so um that's that for what he said then giddy also said his own but kyode decided that he's gonna take us to the sitting room i'm like kyode yeah you have started though you have started this season so i didn't really hear what giddy fire said but I, uh, later on i heard him saying i'm saying something about diana liking him and all of that but i didn't really really grab um his own his own the people that he was talking and the people that he was talking about in general now after they finished their conversation they now went to check on their ladies <laughs> because the ladies were in the other room sleeping in fact the ladies are in one room and the guys are in one room so they now went there to check on all of them like okay how are you guys doing and and all of that then after checking on them well, the next thing i saw shakes and bella in the city in the city room i'm like yeah i'm going to take her out <laughs> I'm gonna drag her out. So they now started having a conversation, obviously about like their situationship. And she was now still talking about like this is not what she wanted to be training for. That she want, she would have preferred. Uh, let it be that okay, Bella won this task. Bella won that task. Not like you know maybe she's now attached to one guy and all. And then he was not like um obviously like she should do what she wants to do. I just feel like you know that we don't have to do this. That like, whatever this is, it's harder to actually like implement it. Yeah, but I can implement it. If that's what you want, because what do you want? Hmm? What do you want? now we have Sheikh saying that he can stay away if that is what she wants, and she's like, "You, what do you want?" And I'm like, "It's not about what he wants now. It's about what you want." Like you're the one that's saying that, okay, um, this is this is not what you planned, and then he's saying that he can do it if it's what you want. You're not asking what he wants, right? Then they were not talking about like what's happening in the house she wasn't like the fact that she doesn't even know that in the house everybody's just angry right like the house is just making everybody feel some type of way and then everybody's just angry that is not seeing the way he's treating her you know that who will not feel some type of way that who will not feel bad about like the way he's treating her right i don't blame this house self. everybody's angry <laughs> what? don't you see it like don't you see what you do uh, how what do i do like how you treat me and everything who wouldn't feel somehow i mean like i enjoy the attention and everything right i don't even know <laughs> kayo they needs to show us this extra treatment though because me i'm not I, the only thing i see is just obviously him showing showing her care doing a few things for her right but I wouldn't really consider it like extra 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 princess treatment like princess treatment is maybe you have to be giving me breakfast in bed every day and then maybe carry me on your head i'm not gonna step on the floor <laughs> don't mind me i'm joking but like yeah kaya needs to like show us more because she had, this is the second time she's saying it and then she's making it seem like the other ladies are jealous of what is what she's getting right which i don't think is the case obviously like some of them might like him and everything but i don't think it's a case of oh he's treating you like this i don't like it you know that kind of thing so i think like that's pushing it a little bit then they were not talking about dancing and no dancing at the saturday night party she was just telling him that okay no he, i think he was he made he made mention of something about like dancing with other people at the party and she was not telling him that hey that he can dance with who he wants now that he can dance with who he wants now that she would also dance with who she wants as i said she was not smiling no <laughs> i'm like do you mean it or you don't mean it because obviously the smile the smile just came across like eh, i'm just saying but i don't really mean it so tomorrow the party is to dance with babes please dance with babes i'll dance with anybody i want to dance with as well okay cool i just want you to laugh then um later on she was like who are even the who are the girls that you even want to dance with then um they now continue the conversation he was now saying that he knows that if he does that if he goes around dancing with other people she's going to like probably just start ignoring him then and then if she also does that he will also start ignoring her if you're comfortable with dancing with other girls go ahead how are the other girls though you know your, your fuse is so short if i'm gonna dance with all the girls that means i should be ready for whatever comes next <laughs> i know what will come next what you free me <laughs> but you know what i'll do if you did that anyway what will you do i'll free you <laughs> so basically they have established that they're not gonna dance with other people because that's what i got from the conversation because her saying or if you feel comfortable dancing with others you should do it if that's what you feel comfortable doing that just felt like emotional blackmail is like okay if that's how you if that's how you roll if that's how you are do it <laughs> i'm gonna be watching to see the reactions if they, they both dance with other people hmm. so that's it for this video thanks for watching and don't forget to give it a thumbs up and i'm going to see you on the next one bye i love you